Hey everybody, Ryan Mayer here. Today I want to talk to you about success in life and consistency. Now, I think we can all agree that we want to be successful in the different areas of life, right? And one of the key factors to success, in my opinion, is consistency. You'll see a lot of successful people that if you really dive in and you look at their life, they were, they were consistent over the course of time. So look at somebody who has a really great marriage. They have consistently shown up and been a good husband or wife and been there and, and was consistently faithful, consistently loving, consistently consistent. They were consistent, right? And so you look at their marriage and you're like, man, that's an awesome marriage. I want a marriage like that. But a lot of times people aren't willing to put in the work or be consistent. When you look at somebody who has a great prayer life, you're like, man, you're a prayer warrior. You're, you know, it seems like you're, you know, God is just, you know, when you pray, God moves or something like that. And you look at how often they pray and how, you know, committed to prayer. The Bible says be devoted to prayer, right? It's all about consistency, being consistent in your prayer life. You're consistent in your relationship with the Lord, spending time with him in the morning, reading the Bible, all that kind of stuff. A lot of times people will say, you know, I don't feel connected to God. I, I want a better relationship with God. Well, how do you get a better relationship with God? Well, we know that scripture says in James 4, 8, that he, if you draw near to him, he'll draw near to you. I've talked about that verse before. And what's so cool about that is that God's always consistent. He's amazingly consistent. He's always loving. He's always caring. He's always giving. He's always good. And he always wants to have a deeper, more meaningful relationship with us. And a lot, so if our relationship is, you know, feels like we're not connected, it's because of us. Because we're not putting in the time. We're not being consistent. So I want to encourage you in any area of your life, when it comes to finances, saving money, um, relationships, your relationship with God, all that kind of stuff, are you being consistent? Think about it. If you're in a marriage and you're faithful, you're faithful, you're faithful, and all of a sudden you're not faithful, well, there's going to be a problem. So consistency is a very big deal. And so I just want to encourage you with that. Think about the different areas of your life and, and are you showing up? Are you being consistent? You know, and even with work and things like that, say you're, you're trying to build social media. This is something I, I actually teach people is if you want to build your social media, you need to be consistent, consistently adding value, consistently putting out content, all that kind of stuff. Because how many pages do you follow that put out content for a small period of time and then all of a sudden they just stop? Are you going to follow them? Uh, anymore or they just drop off for for months at a time and then they decide to pick it back up and they're wondering why isn't my page growing right so it's all about consistency consistency really matters so hopefully I've made my point there but I just I just want to encourage you look at the areas of your life that you want to succeed in which I believe is all of them and are you being consistent if you're not then start making some active steps to be more consistent. And, and, and one tip that I can give you is, is plan your life to the best of your ability. Schedule things. I'm not much of a scheduler or a planner, but I've had to become that way a little bit more because I want to live my life intentionally, right? If I want to be a good husband, if I want to be a good friend, if I want to be a good worker, then you have to plan things out right? You have to plan to be consistent. It just doesn't happen magically. And success doesn't happen magically. So if you if you plan to be consistent, a lot of times you'll eventually become successful in these different areas. So hopefully that's a, a blessing. Hopefully that helps and that makes sense. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching my videos. You guys are awesome. And uh, hopefully this has been a blessing. God bless you guys. Peace.